Assalamu alaikum, brothers and sisters. Welcome to year six of the 17 Verses podcast. I'm your host, Maher Haq. In this podcast, we take a small selection from the Quran every day and recite it to you in plain English, so you can get a small slice of God's word while you go about your day. By averaging 17 verses per day, we're able to break the Quran down into manageable pieces and finish it in one year. If you enjoy the podcast, please help spread the word. Tell your friends and family, subscribe in iTunes or Stitcher or wherever you get your podcasts, and write us a review. Show notes and a text episode can be found at 17verses.com. That's the numbers 17-V-E-R-S-E-S dot com. Today's selection is from Surah 26, Ashuara, or The Poets, verses 160 through 175. These verses talk of the message of Prophet Lot and the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah. The fsir for this selection connects the Muslim telling of Prophet Lot to the biblical narrative in the book of Genesis. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. The people of Lot also disbelieved their messengers. Remember when their brother Lot asked them, Have you no fear of God? Rest assured that I am a trustworthy messenger of God towards you. So fear God and obey me. I do not ask you for any reward for my services, for my reward will be given by the Lord of the worlds. Of all the creatures in the world will you approach males and leave those whom your Lord has created for you to be mates? Nay, you are a people who have transgressed all limits. They replied, If you do not stop, O Lot, you shall become one of those who have been expelled. Lot said, I am certainly one of those who abhor your actions. O Lord, deliver me and my family from their wicked deeds. So we delivered him and all his family, except an old woman who was left among those who remained behind. Then we utterly destroyed the rest. We rained down on them the rain of brimstones, and evil was the rain which fell on those who were forewarned. Surely in this story there is a great lesson. But most of these people do not learn a lesson and become believers. The fact is that your Lord is the mighty, as well as the merciful. Amin. Now a short tafsir on the connection between Prophet Lut, or Lot, in the Quran, and the English narrative in the Bible. Quote, Lut is Lot of the English Bible. His story is biblical. He was a nephew of Abraham and was sent as a prophet and warner to the people of Sodom and Gomorrah, cities utterly destroyed for their unspeakable sins. They cannot exactly be located, but it may be supposed that Sodom and Gomorrah were set somewhere in the plains east of the Dead Sea. The story of their destruction is told in the 19th chapter of the book of Genesis. Two angels appeared in the shape of handsome young men, came to Lot in the evening and became his guests by night. The inhabitants of Sodom, in their lust for unnatural crime, invaded Lot's house but were repelled. In the morning, the angels warned Lot to escape with his family, as told in Genesis chapter 19, verses 24 through 26. Then the Lord rained down upon Sodom and upon Gomorrah, brimstone and fire from the Lord out of heaven, and he overthrew those cities and all the plains and all the inhabitants of the cities, and that which grew upon the ground. But Lot's wife looked back from behind him, and she became a pillar of salt. Unquote. Thank you. This concludes today's episode of the 17 Verses Podcast. I hope that this selection helps increase your understanding of the Holy Quran just a little bit. If you like the podcast, you can subscribe in iTunes or Stitcher and write us a review. Or you can grab the RSS feed and put it into your own podcast app. The show notes, including the text version of this episode, can be found by going to 17verses.com. That's the numbers 17-V-E-R-S-E-S dot com. Thank you, and be well.